Okay, so we have the question that the random variable x has a binomial distribution where binomially distributed with n and p, given that the mean and the standard deviation of x are both equal to 0 0.9, find the value of n and find the value of p. So what I know is that the mean or the expectation of x is equal to 0 0.9. And we know that the standard deviation, so sigma, that is also equal to 0 0.9. Okay, so I mean, the first thing that can help me here is the expectation of x equal to 0 0.9. What I know for the expectation of x for a binomial distribution, this is defined as np. So I've got np equals 0 0.9. Okay, now unfortunately I can't solve this equation because there are an infinite amount of solutions where I can put n in and I can pick a p and it would give me 0 0.9. What I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to set up another equation using the information about the standard deviation so that I get a pair of simultaneous equations. Now the fact that we have sigma equals to 9 means that the variance or sigma squared is equal to 0 0.81. Okay now what we also know is that the variance of x for a binomial is given as n p q, where q is p minus 1. Okay, so what I now know is that n p q is equal to 0 0.81. Okay, so we now have a pair of simultaneous equations. We have simultaneous equation 1, and we have simultaneous equation 2. So what I'm going to do to solve these simultaneous equations is, you could do this by substitution, but actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide one equation by the other. So I'm going to divide the variance by the expectation. So the reason I do this, so we're going to do 2 divided by 1, remember where possible, to give indication as to what it is you're doing. I'm going to do mpq over np equals 0.81 divide by 0 0.9. Now the reason I do it this way round is because I then get the MPs cancel and leave me with Q and then 0 0.81 divided by 0 0.9 is 0 0.9. So what I know now is that Q is equal to 0 0.9. Okay, so if Q is equal to 0 0.9, P is equal to 1 minus Q and so p is equal to 1 minus 0 0.9 is 0 0.1. Okay, so I've got my p. Now I've got my p, I can use that in my equation np. So I'm just going to sub into to 1. Okay, so what I get is 0 0.1 n is equal to 0 0.9. When I divide both sides by 0 0.1, to solve this equation, what I get is that n is equal to 9. So n is equal to 9 and p is equal to 0 0.1. So how do I get my marks on this question? Well, your first marks are given for these two statements here, the two equations that you set it up. You get a statement mark, so that's a b1, for stating that np is equal to 0 0.9. You also get a statement mark for the second equation, B1, for MPQ equals to 0.81. So you can give yourself a mark for each of them. You're then going to get a method mark for the division of the two equations. Okay, so you get a method mark for that there. And you are then going to get your accuracy mark. Having found that Q equals 0 0.9, you're going to get your mark here for finding that P equals 0 0.1. Finally, your last mark is then given for finding that N equals 9. Okay, so statement mark for each of the two equations, method mark for dividing the equations, accuracy mark for each of the P and the N. Hope that all made sense and that you understood it.